I first got involved in the standards as uh, in Malaysia itself, that is uh, my, my home country. Well, uh, I was actually chosen to uh, be ob an observer in my uh, country's uh, technical committee. So that is how I got involved in uh, a little bit on the technical standards and technical committees. And from there onwards, I move on to lead the uh, working group of uh, a local Malaysian standards. So from there, uh, that is why I was actually chosen to represent Malaysia in the uh, Young Professional Workshop uh, this time. Well, the most valuable thing that I actually uh, treasure through this workshop is of course the networking that I gained and garnered throughout the uh, three days uh, program. So there is not much chance for me in Malaysia to get to meet uh, other young professionals to share knowledge and also to exchange knowledge. So this is to me a platform for us to, uh, to know um, other countries, uh, to know um, young professionals of other countries and actually uh, uh, it's a good, very good platform for us to uh, grow together in, uh, in this uh, fraternity. When Malaysia chose me to represent uh, the country, uh, there is actually a, a requirement where when I get back to Malaysia, I have to actually uh, set up a Malaysian National Committee. So that is where, uh, together with me, there are the two other uh, uh, young professionals. When uh, we go back to our uh, country, we are supposed to actually set up the uh, Malaysian chapter of the uh, uh, Young Professional uh, national, uh, of uh, Malaysia itself. The advantages of uh, taking part in this uh, Young Professional program is, of course, uh, as I have my own company, and this actually enhanced the uh, status of my company because we are involved in uh, standard writing and also standard assessments and so on. So this is actually, this actually my company is small, not big like uh, other uh, uh, MNCs, multinational companies. I'm a local uh, local mid or local bond company. So this actually gives me a, a advantage to actually uh, compete with uh, bigger companies. The advice for other young professionals who are actually experts in uh, in, in their own field. Uh, my advice to them is of course um, uh, for for country wise that means Malaysia. Do join us for the uh, Malaysian Young Professional Committee where we'll grow together and one day maybe you'll represent Malaysia just like us to come over and network with other countries. Now the second one, of course, the advice to other young professionals. Now this three days is a very short three days but we hope that uh, the bonding and also the network can grow after these three days where we can actually still exchange ideas through uh, social media, through websites and so on. So to us, to me, it should not stop uh, only at these three days. It has to grow and we hope that uh, Malaysia, uh, the, young pro the young professionals, young professionals workshop or young, the uh, young professional leaders could grow to a, to a bigger group where we can actually get more countries, uh, more participants and uh, be the uh, backbone of uh, IEC.